that I will forgive, but I just can't take a liar. I was by your side till the very end, till you pushed me in the fire. I tried to believe you, but something is wrong. Hey guys, it's Jamie, and today I'm going to be showing you guys how to make some room organization. And um, these are all made out of things that you have around your house, like recyclable, I can't pronounce that, but like materials. And they're really simple to do. So give this video a thumbs up if you like it. And also don't forget to subscribe to help us reach our goal of 1,000 subscribers by the end of summer. And just keep on so watching. So for this uh, DIY, all you'll need is a uh, pop can or something to make your paper mache around. Um, some glue. I'm using this Mod Podge. Some, uh, like a paintbrush for the glue. And then some paint any kind of, or you can like just do put decorative paper over top whatever you want to do and then I'm obviously using a paintbrush for that and then this thing I'm just going to um, do my paper mache on and then obviously you'll need some newspaper or a magazine but newspaper works the best so let's get started flip your pop can upside down then you're gonna want to um, put a bunch of glue around and start putting uh, paper on top Alright, so now you're going to want to let that sit for a couple hours. I would have showed you guys it, but um, it has like my local newspaper on it. I didn't really want to share that information. So, um, yeah, and then after that, you're just going to want to paint it. And, yeah. Alright, so here you can see I have this little thing finished. So I painted the inside of it. It took a while to do, um, just like to let all the paint dry and stuff. It's really simple to do, but it just took a little bit for the paint. Um, and then, uh, yeah, so it's the like this so you can add little decorative things to make it more pretty and add your everyday jewelry in there and it's really simple to do so I hope you guys enjoyed this one. So for this next one all you'll need is some scissors, a pen, uh, some paper, some sticky note things um, and then some tape or glue so let's get started. Your first step is to um, do this <laughs> uh, just cut it out and then make sure it fits and then I'm going to use tape just some clear plain tape and just put it make sure that it's all lined up perfectly and then just do that and then uh, tape all sides and on your little sticky notes all you're gonna do is write down things you have to do so I have to clean my room and edit a video and then um, and then put you can also put uh, when it needs to be done by and then just do that all anytime you need to do something and just kind of like stick it up somewhere and um, yeah, and it's super simple to do and it just kind of helps organize your thoughts if you're not huge into doing like planners or anything like that. This really helps a lot. Alright, so what you're going to want to do is take a box and then some wrapping paper and then just wrap it um, just all pretty or you can use spray paint or whatever and then I made it so a little bit taller um, so I could fit more in it but not too much. <laughs> Alright, so as you can see I have my box um, all nice and um, <laughs> wrapped up and so now I'm going to put it, um, I'm actually going to put mine in my closet so basically this is going to be for if you have um, clothes that you uh, war, but they don't need to be washed quite yet. You can put them in there instead of leaving them on your floor and it will um, Not be as cluttered type of thing <laughs> Or you can use it as a random little bin to put a bunch of stuff You don't know what to do with like extra wallets little um, things like souvenirs and also um, Some extra room decor and stuff like that Everybody 